Olá, sejam bem-vindos a mais um Quem Responde. Hey. Hey. That's good, that's good. Edição especial, mas não muito feliz, né? Por conta do 02. Foi nosso primeiro 02 esse split? Foi. Que bem último. Só tem mais uma semana, né? Então eu já garanti que a semana 02 não vai estar. <risos> no pior dos casos é 03 depois da semana. É. Deus me livre. Uh, so, we have a lot of questions here, but I wanted to start by asking what happens after a zero two. I mean, I understand you guys probably talked a lot to each other. How was that process? Do you guys still like each other? Oh, I hate everyone. We had a big conversation actually. On Sunday? Yeah, on Sunday big after the one. game. Right after the game? Yeah, right yeah. after the game. Okay. And the point is not specifically the zero two, is the way, like, how we stopped improving and actually we got worse actually than before. We messed up a lot our game, so we were trying to look for points, specifically points that could help us. We got some points and we are trying to, to fix that for now because querendo ou não, tipo, é um bom momento, né, pra gente trollar. Sim. Porque é melhor trollar agora do que na pra frente. Eu acho que, sinceramente, foi um momento bom pra dar um estalo assim pra gente. É. Óbvio uhum. que não, ninguém quer jogar assim, a gente não quer jogar mal, a gente não tá feliz com a nossa performance, mas eu acho que foi um bom momento pra gente, mano, acordar e ter, tipo, mais energia pra realmente focar em evoluir, tá ligado? Uhum. So, more specifically, how does that go? Like, you get here and then you sit down and talk, do you watch the replay? How, how was it? I don't want details, like, oh, my first <laughs> cacau, but how did it go? Like, what did you guys do exactly? Nor normally, we watch the game, right? And mm -hmm. we talk about specific points, but as I said, this this talking specifically was not because of that game. We were talking about general, Generally, how okay. we are playing, like worse than before and what was what is the points. So we didn't even watch that game at that moment. We just sit and talk and of course sometimes we use some moments about that game because it's more fresh on our mind. But the points is like more general. Why we are doing that, why we are like maybe more hurry, why we are not uh, communicating as calm as before and this is all points, you know, so. Out of curiosity, how long did that talk take? Around three. Three hours. Two to three hours, I guess. Okay. And after that, we're gonna eat together. Means we are still loving each other. Okay. Uh, so today's your first day of practice this week. How did that go? Zero cinco. No, I don't mean results, but like, <laughs> did it improve somehow after the talk? Did you guys feel any difference going forward? Zero five. Was it really? <laughs> Because the info I got when I got here was, oh, they look kind of sad today. I was here this morning and they look kind of sad and beaten up. Is that true? Are you guys sad? Are you guys motivated? Tell me, I want to know your feelings. I think everyone is motivated to, to get better. We are mad, you know, because we are playing bad. So yeah, I can imagine. So we want to play more, you know, but mm -hmm. we need to wait the whole week to play again. We yeah. really want to play more. We want to play better than we did on last, split, last weeks. <coughs> Right. So, of course, on Scream we are like... Yeah, today to everyone improve, was really serious to play. Uh, one of our points was we should try to take the training as similar as it possible to the stage. Mm -hmm. Of course, can't be. It's impossible to be like as much as focused that you are on stage because of a lot of reasons like enemy is not playing right to you are not playing 100% right to so it's this different game just you know it's and it's a difficult better. process because if you think about it like you said it was a good time to have a crisis and i agree because it's better to have it before playoffs but we only have one more week before playoffs start and you have a limited time so it's kind of sure, sure. i'm sure it's a little bit nerve-wracking right because yeah, 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 the yeah, fact definitely. that you only play two games per weekend and you have a limited amount of practice that you can do as a team and you're playing bad i'm sure it's like oh. Yeah, kind of yeah, sucks. Exactly. That's exactly the feeling. But how do you feel wiser? The wiser we saw on Sunday, <laughs> is it going? To, is he going to show up again? Was like one of the like the worst game that I've had in like in in a month, and it appeared on the stage, you know. Mm -hmm. So of course I wanna play a game. I wanna play next match, you know, to right. prove that we have more and we could play way better. I can play better. Do you know why it happened? Oh, of course, I of course I know because <laughs> okay. I made it. I'm just looking for uh, control my mindset and mm -hmm. improve for the next game. So I, I'm asking really annoying questions because I feel like this is a place for you guys to talk to the fans and the fans, they're not happy, of course. And one of the reasons
reasons they're not happy is because uh, we were losing pretty badly on Sunday and some of you guys were laughing on camera. Why were some of you guys laughing on camera even when we had such Porque a bad performance? Porque a gente tava falando que o jogo tava muito feio. Mm. So we were laughing out of like, damn, this is bad. Yeah, tipo, yeah. quando a gente pegou o Baron, foi no domingo, né? Yes. A gente pegou o Baron, a gente respirou e deu bem, né? E falou yeah, muito That was feio, exactly the moment when we left. Like, we look at, we look at other, each other and, and oh my god. Oh my yeah. god, what yeah. else? Messy, you know? so. The whole situation was really crazy, like we engaging a lot and we dying a lot and the game was messy as fuck so mm -hmm. that's why we left in the, in the, in that, because on that moment after we get Nash, finally we could have like a control of the game. You know? Right, I, I want to defend you guys because laughing doesn't always mean you're making fun out of the situation. Mm -hmm. Sometimes you just laugh because you're nervous or you don't have a proper reaction. It's like, it's not. If they're crying, it doesn't make a difference. Some people were saying that you're probably very upset because you're carrying your top side. Do you agree with that? Carrying my coach. Yeah, because they were feeding a lot and you were trying to win by yourself. Because I know League of Legends doesn't work like this, but for some fans they think, oh my gosh, Titan is, Titan is, is has a positive KDA, so he must be carrying and he's angry because people are feeding. How does that feel for you as an AD carry? I don't think I was angry, but it was... I was more angry because we are having that game against Fluxo and they are screaming at us so I was thinking oh my oh, okay. fucking god why these guys are screaming at me you know and I don't want it to win so badly mm -hmm. and the uh, game, game was really hard I went not mad because of our mistakes of course it's it's annoying, it's frustrating, annoying. right? That used to happen to me a lot long ago when Nidalee Nidale was meta in the mid lane and I played with BRTT and I spent 20 minutes in laning phase, dodging Nidalee Qs, and then when bot lane came mid, BRTT got hit by a spear, and I was like, oh my god, why? So I imagine it's like this frustrating feeling, but just so the fans understand, you're not hating each other because someone's having a bad game, right? No. When I joined the pain gaming, I could felt that we we help each other so much, so much you know. Mm -hmm. When we are having some problems, like with individual performance and, and performance like that, uh, everyone hug each other and try to help these things, you know. Not mm -hmm. judging, oh, you, why, why you are feeding so much zero aid, what, you, you know, it's not like that. So on the other side of the coin, Kaka, how do you feel about that regarding your team? Like, are you like, oh, I'm sorry guys, it was my fault, or? I think everyone knows it was my fault, like, that game, and I feel really mad. Uh, at yourself of myself because I made a lot of mistakes like since game starts until game finish I'll try to use that for getting better next game and mm -hmm. I think it's more about my, my focus my decisions I need to be more more calm I think we had good talking good conversation so I hope and I think it, this will make us play better for next week I'm sure it will like if it helps any of the angry fa fans I'm sure you guys will forget this sometime from now but you will remember this forever yeah, I still like, remember some individual mistakes I made from like 10 years ago if he's a good player because you'll never forget it it won't happen again right that's growing as a player Machuca os fãs, mas a gente vem mais, né, mano? Yeah. Tipo, naquela hora lá que eu falei, caralho, mano, o pior jogo da minha carreira, esse pá. É uma reação do momento também, não... Às vezes parece que, ah, porque você tá perdendo, você é obrigado a ficar puto e chorando e... Não é mudar alguma coisa ali na, naquela hora? Não, eu tava muito puto com aquele cara gritando pra nós. Só acho dele que ele vai estar no playoff, olha aí, Jiqueiro. Não ia mais essa cara dele. E os caras só veem eu gritando, né? E ele... Nunca. Ah, eu tô, vejo, tô eu fico quieto até visto, o cara gritar, visto, mano. Ele ficou visto. levantando os braços pra você mil vezes quando você tava morrendo. Levantou pra caralho. <risos> <laughs> okay, Kuri, you're really quiet and I know you don't like to talk a lot. People are going to be angry if I don't ask you. What do you think about this situation? What do you think about our situation? <laughs> Thank you. Huh? <laughs> bad. Well, I don't know why. You don't know why? <laughs> <laughs> now I know. Okay. I talk a lot with Kaka, what we need to do. Because they play jungle sport together a lot and mm. kill Kaka. Your English is good! Yes. <laughs> <laughs> uh -huh. Vou só fazer uma última pergunta pra você, Kaka. Pergunta. Vai mandar, vai. If, uh, I mean, I, I think why Vi again is a boring question. So I want to ask, why are you underperforming on, on Vi? Because everyone knows your listening is amazing. Everyone knows your Vi is good. Everyone knows... Amazing! Why? <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> Everyone knows you can play really well, but for some reason you're not. Why do you think that is? Is that a confidence problem? Is that a communication problem? Maybe you're talking too much and not paying attention to your own gameplay. Is it because Wiser is not controlling the waves properly? Is it because Dinkedo is playing bad? Is it because Dinkedo uh, Titan is dying? What's what's happening? Good question. Yeah. <laughs> Cara, te pegou de jeito, hein, minha... É, foi uma pergunta. Vou salvar? Quer me salvar? É. True teammate. Quer falar o quê? For me, it's like that. It's just my opinion. He can think different, so he, he can talk. But when we are in front of in front of objective, it's more harder to play Vi. We, as a team, need to know how we should play with Vi, you know? So we need a, we need more practice, that's what I think. But on Sunday, I think it was more my bet than ever team. Because mm -hmm. I didn't focus well. I guess Kabum, I think, was more what he said. Because I think I made good in the game. Você acha que tipo o jogo contra Kabum foi um pouco mais sobre a vai? E o jogo de domingo foi mais. É, o jogo tipo, de domingo. Podia estar de seu... qualquer boneco, é. que se tivesse jogado igual, teria morrido o Brasil. Ela tava entre o monitor é. e o teclado. É, <risos> é, <exatamente. risos> Eu acho que. Tipo, you... Não, esse final de semana eu joguei mal, realmente. Uhum. Mas, tipo, por exemplo, no final de semana de passado, que eu tava de DCIM. Tipo, eu não acho que eu fiz jogos horríveis, tá ligado? Uhum. Tipo, claro que em alguns momentos, pelo boneco ser. Tipo, ali sim, se eu errar uma vez, fica muito mais... Fica feio, fica evidente. É, evidente, tá ligado? Tipo, se eu errar de Maokai ou de Hell, tipo, as pessoas esquecem, tá ligado? Um pouco que foi falado na nossa conversa é que a gente precisava olhar primeiro pro nosso individual, depois falar coisas de time, tá ligado? Pô, eu já sei, tipo, jogo LoL há muito tempo já, tô no cenário há muito tempo, e eu sei minha capacidade, tá ligado? Eu sei que esse jogo final de semana não me define. So I just wanted to correct something from last video, because some of you guys thought that we didn't know about the Darius pick. We knew about the Darius pick, we just didn't know how to play really well against Darius. E esse foi o Pen Responde. Ah. Por mais que tenha sido um vídeo com perguntas chatas, eu acho que vocês conseguem sentir que o clima do time não está. Ah, oh, merda! Tá... É promessa, se a gente ganhar o CBLO, vou tatuar a vibe. Ai, 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 esse cara de que. Podia tatuar o Frank, né? Tipo, vai, Zé. <risos> Muito obrigado por assistir e não esqueçam de assinar o canal, deixar os comentários de vocês aí no vídeo, clicar no sininho. Torcer pra gente melhorar e a gente se vê na semana que vem. Pode cortar essa parte da vai, tá? <risos> Pronto. <risos>